welcome to this week's tip of the week where we will be reviewing how to avoid opening the bill of materials and opening the item master data instead. Some users can run into a challenge when an item is also set up as a bill of materials and when you go to click on the item to drill into it and you're expecting to open the item master data, it opens the bill of materials instead, which can be frustrating if a user isn't familiar with how to navigate to the item master data, and it just adds a few extra steps. There is a feature in SAP 10.0 um, within the general settings on the inventory tab and the item sub tab called open item master data instead of bill of materials of a bomb item when selecting link area arrow. So if we go into SAP, we can kind of walk through how this feature works. So if we open up the general settings under system initialization, you'll see that this checkbox is not checked. So if we are trying to, let's say we're opening a sales order and there's an item on there where you want to view the item mastery data, but when you open it, the bill of materials uh, displays instead. So although you can drill in from the bill of materials, it just again adds an extra step, which can be frustrating. So if we click on the checkbox and hit update and then go back to the sales order, it will now open up the item master data. So you really have a choice of which document or whether you like the bill of materials or the item master data to appear first. And you can also drill into the bill of materials from the production data tab. And if you right click on it, so there still are easy ways to open the bomb from the item master data. This just can, if you have this set up, it can kind of remove a few extra clicks and just save you some time in the long run. This feature does provide benefits just because you can easily access the item master data or the bill of materials, whichever way you have it set up. Um, and there are still ways to easily access the item master data or bill of materials or vice versa. And it overall just saves time for users, which can be really beneficial um, when working in SAP. I hope that this tip was helpful and it will be utilized to the full potential in its future. Thank you for listening. Uh, uh, uh.